Hundreds of friends and relatives paid their final respects to a Singaporean woman who was killed after she slipped off a cliff in a New York state park. The body of the 39-year-old was laid to rest after a 22-hour flight home from the United States. Many say she'll be remembered as a kind spirit and a passionate animal lover. Alavamsha has this report. A long journey back from halfway across the globe, but Noor Aisha is home at last. Streams of friends and family have come to bid farewell. Many are still reeling from the tragedy. When she stay here, she makes friends with everybody. Yeah. So it's a great loss. It's a great loss. She's gone. She's always like the ray of sun, like sunshine, always lifting up the room, so she has this really beautiful smile. Miss Aisha died after falling 30 metres from an icy cliff in the New York State Nature Park. Those tragic moments unfolding before the eyes of her husband, Ralph Syed, as hours of rescue efforts came to nothing. Today, he's a husband in deep grief, sending the woman he calls his soulmate off on her final journey. He's too distraught to speak to us on camera, so a friend is doing so on his behalf. He has taken the time to process it slowly. Uh, he has received a lot of support from not just people in the US back then, with some of the uh, people who were helping with the late ICE. Uh, he also received a lot of uh, support from ICE's friend who was in the US who flew in to meet with Ralph, and also of course uh, the sisters and uh, his family members who were all the way with, with him. Mr. Farhan says Miss Aisha would often adopt stray cats and has 40 at home. Stories of her passion and deep love for animals will continue to live on. She's, you know, really all out uh, wanting to help and especially when it came to the voiceless animals, that's what she's been really into. I recall um, an incident where we were about to go for a meeting and we came in, in separate vehicles, uh, but ICE was late because along the expressway she saw a dead cat. Then she, wanted to, she actually stopped to pick up the carcass to put it aside, so that was ICE. The same U.S. park that Miss Aisha fell from had previously claimed two lives in 2021 and 2015.